Yeah. Yeah. That's fantastic. That's, that's, that's the, I, I would actually probably stir in some of the salsa just to give it a little kick, but it is very. Was it less than three bucks? Uh, I think it's like the whole thing chips in there. It's like four bucks or five bucks. With the chips, that's uh, yeah. solid. Chipotle's too expensive. Like four okay, bucks so these are normally yeah. written for oh. parties of four. Right. Target. So Last I need to like, was, uh, crank it up a little bit. I'll oh, crank it up a lot, man. Go to 11. <laughs> I'm going to seven. There's seven. How many of us are there? There's seven? Yeah, that's the maximum yeah. table size, right? That's yeah. okay. They just keep having me roll on uh, something like that. Are you okay with the character name? Halulu. Halulu? Halulu. Halulu. Like the alcohol. This is not like the alcohol. That's Kalua. You're not going to need to remember that. She's There's off the island. There's a chance. What? Every two Someone's got to go. Oh, 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 Every time I cast it. Is it Rocker's no, turn? First level and above. If I roll a yeah, one. Uh, we can always like go chase off again. Random magic pet cast. <laughs> 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 hey, you owe to his college fund now for dropping that S line. That's a five, five dollar. Is that how this works? Yeah. It's not bad. David's got to get three. Damn, three of them through, so it's five bucks a pop. Pepto Bismo, the halfling thief. I can't be little skittles. First of all, I want to let you know that I think you're an amazing parent. That you're a very good parent, that your parental skills are second to none. Not a very good thrower, though, is that the word? <laughs> Something with your children and throwing stuff. <laughs> yeah. Which one's the theme? We got a theme you going. Do you know how long it took him to try to get the He almost got the head shot. He had a chance. Now, this is where Wait, this is better than that. He did get a head shot. <laughs> so. We can talk about it, you know, we'll work through this. Give him my writer, I can give the writer a channeling. He has your skittles. I know, and he's not giving them. Like, seriously, the skittles are too much. Everybody. We're going to go on that for one inch. That's all I'm saying. No, we destroyed the Ripple Dice for the last year. You guys already chatted with the uh, okay. Goblin and the Hatmoker? What's your new character? Oh, they still there. Has been Thaddeus Mallet, the halfling sorcerer, who's been in the sun a little too long. Right. It's a conversation. Tell me about it. He sees strings that. everywhere that connect everything. Uh, 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 Wild magic. Do uh, the sorcerers have packs? Do you have a pack? No, no, no. It's a web. I, I have a uh, power source. You have a power source? And mine is the chaos that infuses the uh, universe. David, you're gonna love my traits though. I bluntly say what other people are hiding. Traits. Okay, personality traits. I never have a plan. And my flaws. Or it's not stealing if I need it more than somebody else. <laughs> My aunt must never know the deeds I did as a member of the Red Brand. Are you a Red Brand? No, no, I guess that was an evil cult. Are you a female character? Do you want to be my aunt? No. <laughs> Uh, David, you I, dated, I don't want no did you date my right aunt? <laughs> is it true? True or false? You dated my aunt. Exactly. How old are you? This is why you find out. Depends if is there an age table? There was. Wait, what are you playing, Dave? What's that? What are you playing? Halfling rogue. <laughs> Let's just go with you. You're too young to remember that, Dave. Oh. Oh. Also, who was <laughs> My guy's probably not big on nails. Age. A halfling reaches adulthood at the age of 20 and generally lives in the middle of his or her second century. So I'm going to do a 20 plus 36. Yeah, it's David. You're right. Neck beard. I'm 34. 34? 34. 34. That means I'd have to be at least be 54. <laughs> Wait, what are you? What? Oh, you're halfway. Halfway. 
That would be ancient. That's what I was thinking. This is super old. Well, no, David's trying to figure out if I dated his yeah. My aunt can never know the evil deeds I did as part of the Red Brands. And who are the Red Brands? Not really sure. <laughs> <laughs> kind of new to this. <laughs> yeah, like some Neve's guild in uh, the starting module. That, Boom. that no longer like, applies. I don't know if it really applies here, but yeah. Did I actually give myself a quick I might be walking out of a crib with nothing but a smile and a cat. <laughs> but it's a mighty rod I hold. <laughs> Remind me when we're done to get like a vlog for me because I don't have any. Did Chase just say he loved a mighty rod? <laughs> My character is holding a mighty rod. <laughs> With a smile. <laughs> this is not good news, Chase. <laughs> this is not good news. <laughs> it is. It is. I got something. Do you know the wizard oh, glass anyway. staff? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do. I have kind of like white chain cane, man. I'm the only bard left. Well, we got the pseudo the bard, bard who's going yeah, home tonight. The bard. <laughs> He's going home. <laughs> He's going home, man. Oh, dude, I, I paid. I, I pulled my weight. You should just start out with that that tune. Yeah, it helps with like every other week. So, so how does I get? I'm very dirty. That indestructible creature. In general, it's a character. Their mom was very dirty. Oh. Did you know her? <laughs> Are you talking about my aunt? <laughs> yes. <laughs> she must never know. <laughs> oh, my aunt has a name. Dude, look, no one wants to talk about what you did with that goat. I do this. Eric, ask me, Judge Bolt, and I'll see if I can get that. I see I don't think they know. <laughs> no, we're not making it up as we go. I don't think they know. Should be half the fun of this character. Probably, a, a, I'm a wizard with, or no, I'm a sorcerer, so it's like, I have a good name. I have a good name. I have a like a five. What? You're as smart as me. But I'm better looking than I How do I get, how do you get sneak attack? That's how I get away with the versatile mighty rod. How do you get sneak attack in this edition? Carefully. Um, that was great there is another, is it flying? Oh, there's an adjacent ally. Yeah, I get the five foot ally thing, but then flanking is the other. Yeah, no, there's no there's advantage. Another, another ally in melee. Well, if you have advantage, you automatically have sneak attack, and then also if there is another ally within ally five, within yeah. five that isn't incapacitated. That's not incapacitated. Gotcha. So that's all I start with, though. I got nothing. This certainly made it easier. It was kind of a pain having to get around the random guy. Yeah. Especially if they were a larger size. Side out. Armor class 14. Hit dice 1d8. Hit point roll, Jack. You ready? Whenever I make silly roll, 1920. Constitution plus one. Attack rolls? Season one. No, no, this is my first level hit points. Oh, it's in there. Nine. You're trying to get it. Yeah. You all got anything about that? Level you just get the full amount of one. Nine. I'm at nine. It's just that the wizards will get one shot. One shot, you kill that house guy. Does that mean imagine rolling a one and you have a negative one constitution modifier? Yeah, it's nice. Start over. So, like, pricing hard just to beat the ball there. Oh man, when I make a dexterity stealth check or a check using my thieves tools, my proficiency bonus is double. That's plus four, man. Get the ones out of your system. Play that card. You don't like not That's pretty sweet. Did you see that solid one? No, no, there is one that's coming that will make a solid gold d20 for you. It costs like $250. Yeah. 
How much? 250. That's not bad. It must be small. For a single D20. No, it was. It was horrible. Those ones that are carved out of rock are like 85. No, those first ones are good. I saw a set of uh, gold wood, which is like this gold wood. It's like a year and a half. $230 for a full set. The first GP it was in was only a two of them. Yeah, I spent the GP. The first GP was a two of them. It's kind of expensive, but... I did my research on snowboards, because I was like, do I play snowboards? Yeah, I spent seven bucks on plastic. Do I play snowboards? I spent seven bucks on plastic. I had a ten on every one. Oh my god, these are good. I did my research on Bob. Go inside the tumor. We peeked in. That was it. Okay, so the alarm is on. Curtis, he's as bad as Curtis's dice. If you look close, actually, it pulls a little bit. You can feel it stealing your soul, dude. Was, was it Curtis? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Curtis is the worse. Were they worse? Yeah. And more See with the little bag. That was the worst part. Yeah. So freaking ugly. Rico's got those cool thorn dice. Those are awesome. I'm kind of dull down. I can't play my big dice. Yeah, but then. Kind of sad. Which ones? I have a pit. They're like about this size, but they're spongy. Oh, so you can feel like yeah, like they're all. Like, I can't find them. I don't know where they went. I misplaced them somewhere. But yeah, you can just chuck them across the table. Did you change your dice from last week? Or are you sticking with them? Sticking with them. Solid. They're in a happy mood tonight. They're, they're your feel. They feel it. Yeah. They, they're good. We watched your wedding video. Oh. That is very very funny. Oh yeah. yeah. Congratulations. Truly really fantastic. Way. What? Congratulations. Thank you. How long ago was that? Um, um, going getting close to two years, We're actually. Oh, yeah. belated congratulations, then. I thought that was recent. Well, when's our boy getting married? Did you see their wedding video? I did. What do you think, man? I, I saw, the first time I saw it was like, good luck with the sales pitch. <laughs> <laughs> good luck with the sales pitch. Let's do it. Let's go, Dan. All right, cool. Most of that was my idea, just saying. All right. <laughs> We're getting the pictures. There it is, Camille. Well, you have to get a U60. Oh, there's the map. Yes. <laughs> Where did they find me? I was not with this group. Oh, do you know how you can survive with this? What's up? We're going to survive at the end of every movie, both of us. Okay, you're hogtied. Can I be hogtied too? You just got there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm new to this party as well. And I'm also a halfling. We're hogtied together. Hey, don't leave me hanging. There you go. You guys are both hogtied. Is that a secret? They're going to shoot right now. Okay. Your aunt would be so disappointed in you. <laughs> Eric, no! that's you guys. Oh. All right. Well, that's them. Yeah. Yeah. You, uh, what's up? The bandits uh, wanted to see if uh, <laughs> if anything would come out of the room. So they won the over the head. They're talking together in the hall. That's very hard. We're just in the wrong place. All right. You're welcome. Are you guys outside or did you go back in? Because it was so nice to see you when they came back out again. You are an amazing one. I came in for a little bit. Are you in the tomb? I don't think we went no, in the tomb. We, we were like right at the, the foot of the tomb. We looked inside. We set up an alarm. We set up an alarm. We already set up the alarm so it's clear. There are at least two tents. That goes in. It's 10 feet wide and 10 feet high. And it doesn't look that long, but it's pretty dark. Let's go straight into the hell. What do you guys want to do? I gotta check out our uh, long time friends. Alright. I'll walk in. Yeah. Perception yeah. checks or whatever. You're Goliath, right? Yeah, I'm Goliath. So I'm Perception check. Oh, yeah. Roll for me. You're in there. Okay. Two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <one>. away. <laughs> Hello up there! <laughs> Could you lend a hand, sir? They look dead to you, like as far as you can tell. Are they emaciated? We're not dead yet. Are they dead? Are they dead? No, they're not. Hello! Are you gonna help them? I'm gonna kick them, see if they're alive. I dodge so he hits Dave. I'm just gonna allow that. 
I'll take the I'll take one kick. <laughs> All right. So I mean, that's what you uh, 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 over. Uh, under. So uh, were you awake? Were you asleep? I was asleep. I missed first breakfast, and I'm furious. <laughs> so I'm very hungry, and now I'm being rudely awoken from my mid-morning nap by this barbarian. <laughs> barbarian. That was a deal. The Goliath. Sir, untie us immediately, or you will have to deal with the red brand. I think he's deaf. He hasn't heard me yet. <laughs> he's definitely dumb. Apparently, no one else is coming. The two. Oh, are you guys just right? hanging out outside? I'm, okay. I'm gonna pick them up. I'll let them come and just like walk them back out. Deal with these. All right. And just dump them at their feet. So here you go. Hey, you forgot the luggage. <laughs> I'd like to burn the rope. Burn the rope. rope. With them tied up? Yeah. Yes. Run in there. Yes, I can burn the rope up. You know, we're going to be voting at the end of this. <laughs> How would you like to try this? Produce flame, right? Yeah, produce flame. Just produce flame? Okay. Uh, well, she holds it in her hand. Yeah. Yeah. Do you throw it at them? No, I just hold it in my hand and I get the rope and I just let it burn the rope. You're a fire genasi, right? Yeah. 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 Warlock? Yeah. I stare at you with rapt attention and I go, the strings around you are really weird. Fire choked off by I was going to say, you guys have to make a dex check. Okay. Dex check. The same. Oh, wait. I'm going to do my Tides of Chaos. Advantage. Okay. <laughs> That's an eight. That's an eight. No, it gave me three extra points. But at any point that you can have me roll, I say, just say, do it. Why? I get advantage on an attack save or check once per long rest, and you, the DM, can have me roll uh, a vile surge at any time, and I regain the ability. Interesting. But just at any time, you're just like, roll on the table. You're all the No, I am a light foot half wing charger of chaos surges. Come up with something that might trigger I've got a 16. 16. Okay. 16. Okay. You are able to. <laughs> you're able to flop down to the ground and roll. Correct. The fire goes out, but it's weak enough to burst the rope. Absolutely, it is. You guys get out. You get singed a little bit. How much? Not too often. <laughs> Let's see. One. All right. I take the pain and wrap the tension as I stare at the strings around her. He doesn't mind because he stares at the string. And as soon as my hands are free, I'm like, your demonic powers are choking off your natural abilities. Look at this string that's coming off you. I wonder what this does. I wrap it around my hand and a fire produces. I just got a new power. <laughs> Fix my tail, I get fireball. I stole some of her power. Because she'll never be able to learn it. <laughs> and I'd like to create in this, uh, give yourself uh, a. Uh, what do you call those? Can I have a hit point back? Inspiration. No. Inspiration. <laughs> Sweet. I got an inspiration. Your inspiration is? What does that do for me? Uh, you can basically um, re roll something. And hey, you can give them an ally. <laughs> <laughs> Can it be a negative? 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 Can it be a no. Start a fighter. No. But they did leave us in the tomb as bait for some hideous beast, which I believe we should go kill. We, we did do that, yes. Yes. Uh, but we have a good reason. Uh, it's, it's, we needed to know, you know, if the, the beast, if there is a beast, was there. Basically, we didn't want to go. Do we know what kind of beast it is? No. Okay. You have no idea what kind of beast it is. You should wait. Who's telling us about the map or So it's probably some sort of like undead monstrosity. You should know that Thingamabobs never eat half ones. Thingamabobs. Thingamabobs. They never eat half ones. We tried to explain this to you before you threw us in there as bait. 
that you know the creatures just don't like eating it. Now Sturf Nebelin, on the other hand, are very tasty treats to all manner of underground beasts. I've always sent him in first with like a rope around him. It's a spider. Spider's only good. At the end of the day, it's up to you guys. We're gonna back away. Yes. They kind of just throw off. They have like a blind, like a hunting line. Yes. And they're kind of just sitting here watching you. My God, does not mess with my Well, let's send in the Goliath. Please, sir. You are the stealthiest. Yes. With the chain mail and the. Uh, it's a 10 foot ceiling. How tall are you? Of uh, 7 8. You can't even stretch. It's like being in a small air pool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's like two days later. You come in here. Well, it's kind of dark. Towards the end of the hallway. Do you have dark? Uh, no, but I do have a drift glow. Drift glow. All right. Well, that. Cool. well no, no, that's light. Let's be sneaky. I don't really. Uh, you can send it out. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so it's like five feet of it. That was dark. Stretch, 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 right there. That's what that means. Alright, Stealth is not in my vocabulary. Stealth is not in my vocabulary. Don't even worry about it. You just gotta walk again. We're supposed to work. Large. Yes. This opens up quite a bit. It's a big square room. Ah, uh, you wanna go? Sure. Right behind us. Are you guys here right behind us? Yeah. I'm right behind the warlock playing okay. with my new power. My blade? What? You play with my blade? My new power. Sure. <laughs> what do you want to call it? <laughs> Well, I've got my new power in one hand and my mighty rod in the other. It's a good dance. You can tell me it is. I'm so excited. I just put three dollars. Well, you get the rod of... I got the rod of happening might. I just threw it in two hands. It makes all the Goliaths lush in uh, modesty. It makes you some of those people. Yes! That that snaps my attention. I go, oh, strings! You play strings. I play the strings too. And I start humming and chanting. And you hear this eerie chant on the wind. <laughs> it's a little creepy. I'm voting this guy off for sure. <laughs> I have had more than enough of this kookiness. <laughs> you can handle my. Well, I'm sure you can take care of it with that burning hand. It doesn't prevent enemy, you know. I like her. I stole the power from her. She's very powerful. What up, Beetle? This is Greg. Hey, Greg. Very love to join the They're at nine now. Okay, yeah, get him in here, man. You were running your. Two players. Okay. I'm going for the new player challenge again. Cards. See, there's new players who need cards. So I guess we found another person tied up in the hallway. Yes. David's got room down there. Put him against the wall. Up against the wall. Jack, body check. Jack, you're gonna have to go up. There's only one way out, and you gotta go up. You guys just gonna be okay? Just jump. No, stand up the chair. Oh yeah, I mean, here's a DCI card, right? Oh, no. Where's your